Hello people, how are you all doing? I want to talk to you about microwaves. Ooh. Do you like using your microwave? Three minutes, nice and quick, meal all done. You lazy fat sods, learn to cook. I'll tell you why. Did you know NASA done an experiment with some microwaves? Oh yes, they took two little goldfishes. Let's call them goldfish one and goldfish two. Hello, I'm goldfish one. Hello, I'm goldfish two. Well, NASA took the water from goldfish one, put it in the kettle, or put it in the pan, put it in the kettle, and no matter what I've done, I heated it up to boiling point, they boiled the water, they let it cool down, and they put the goldfish back in, and ooh, goldfish went swimming away, all happy and lovely dovey. Now, second goldfish, they heated the water up, in the microwave. Hmm. Hmm. Guess what happened then, people? Well, I'll turn all to cool down. Go fishing number two. Look back into the water. And swimmy, swimmy, swimmy. He died. Now, people. Think about this for a second, if you will. What are our bodies made up out of? The majority of our bodies are made up of the water. Now, for a goldfish to die in water, well, it's probably bluntly, it's not water, is it? Water is H2O. Hydrogen and two oxygen. H2O. Now, if the goldfish died, that means in the process of being heated up in the microwave, the water no longer became water. It turns into something else which is isn't, no, well, it's not quite water, is it? It can't be. It's been x-rayed, it's been radiated, it's been microwaved. It's not the same, people. Now imagine, if you're doing that to all your food, the majority of everything in this world that we eat is made up out of water. Now, you're putting things into your microwave, you're heating them up, and then you're changing them chemically, and you're putting it into your body. Hmm, just a little something for you to think about, people. Like and subscribe.